Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I mentioned in my whip and chat the other day that I got some bargain buys from B&M stores here in the UK. Sadly, they don't do delivery. They're not an online selling website. Um, they are just like a store that you go into um, and I can't guarantee which stores will have these. But uh, the store that our daughter goes to uh, had these bargains in and they are from craft buddy crystal art uh yeah they are discontinued ones i believe because i did look on the website and they don't have these in anymore but they were an absolute bargain so it would have been rude not to get them so i thought you might like to have a look so i have two lion king items and a disney princess item so look at that we've got moana in a little crystal art notebook the notebooks are normally around about, I think, 10 or £12-ish. And these were £1.67 each. I mean, how ridiculous is that? They did have a Smurf one as well, but I'm not really keen on Smurfs. So I don't know. I, I aren't particularly bothered about having that one. And the 30 by 30 canvas, we've got uh, Simba and his mum and dad. And uh, is it Zazu, the little bird there? That one is normally around about 19 99 because it's a 30 by 30 and that was £5. So, yeah, you just can't go wrong, can you, if you're wanting them as presents or whatever. The only thing is with stores like B&M, they tend to get things in like end of ranges or end of lines. And then when you go back next time, they're not actually there. So it is a case of more or less buying them when you see them. But yeah, it would have been rude not to get them for these prices. So let's have a look at the canvas first. So yeah, all the lovely um, Craft Buddy Crystal Art uh, packaging. It is just wonderful. I do feel as though you've got a present, don't you, when you get these. Uh, yeah, it says it's partial, but I think this looks like full drill to me. But we'll have a look when we uh, say, oh, I suppose it's partial because maybe the eyes haven't got any gems on so but yeah this was one of the original disney kits that came out they have got others out since um, and i suppose they have to start uh, getting rid or running down some of the kits and discontinuing them so that they can continue to have the newer kits in so we're all nicely packaged yeah it is edge to edge drills it is literally just the eyes on the lion and um, even zazu's fully crystals are fully gems um that uh, that don't have any gems on so that's why they have to call it a partial but yeah it's all pre-framed as well so you don't have to worry about getting a frame for it it's all ready done and it is one of the older style kits so it has got one of the better tool kits in it oh, just get rid of the bit of cardboard there Okay, so look at all those gems. How many colours have we got? We'll have a look in a second. These are resin uh, gems as well, resin drills, uh, not the acrylic ones. So they tend to have more facets on them and they're a little bit more sparkly. And then the tool kit. So this says one of the original tool kits that, that they used to bring out with the canvases. So it has the little pot with the wax in, which they don't this one's alive they don't do the pots anymore um, or I've not seen them in the, any of the new kits for a while so it's got two rounds of wax with your plastic coating on the top so remember to take that off you get your two purple squishes to match in with your two white pens with the gorgeous crystal art uh, purple foil on there i do think that looks classy single places one end three places at the other so yeah good little pens and then you get about 20 grip seal bags which are always exceptionally handy particularly doing special drill projects and a little white boat and a little flat bottom boat with a spouting so yay i do like the little pots of wax they do I don't know, it just stops it from drying out. I, um, yeah, I don't like the tool kits. I think they're like getting an extra little present with it. I know if it's just your standard pen button, wax your green tray and everything, but these tend to be just that little bit extra special. 
and I do like those. <laughs> right, put those out of the way. I've taken the bags out because I need some for downstairs while I'm doing special drill Christmas projects. Uh, you get your old um, style, get your old style generic leaflet. This one only has four languages on it. The new ones now have six different languages on them. And it actually shows you this one on here, look, as well. And uh, some of the other products that they do tells you what you get in your kit. And uh, your little tool kit there as well. Uh, oh, this one's a 27 different uh, colours. And it has no specials in it at all. There's no ABs, there's no special crystals. They put the key code on the back of the canvas and you've got your little thing there to tell you to cut it off to use it if you wish to. I tend to cut it off and copy it and then put it onto my little tubs when I kit it up. But yeah, for £5 I think this is excellent. Brilliant, there's like little stocking fillers or presents for people. But it's possibly not one that I would have picked to do myself but I've fallen into that trap of, yeah, it's definitely going to be got uh, going to be done for £5. <laughs> Especially pre-framed, I mean, 30 by 30 actual frames are quite hard to get hold of um, and even getting a frame for £5 is uh, quite hard to do. I'm going to have a quick look at the GMs, at the colours. So, ooh, look at all these, wonderful. I do like Craft Brigade for the charting. They always go that extra mile. They always put that extra colour in. You know, like on this main here, we've not just got one or two colours. There's actually one, two, three. I think there's four different colours working through this main. So you get all that depth and all that shading just to make it, you know, that little bit. Well, I want to say realistic because it's car it's a cartoon, isn't it? But just to make it that little bit more special, more thought out. Okay, so we've got a pumpkin colour. Uh, a beige colour and a sort of caramel chocolate colour and a denim blue and a washed denim blue and another blue and a burgundy colour. It's practically the same colour as the packet, that one. And a very, very pale pink and another couple of blues. That's like a navy and a tan colour. And oh, look at that jady green. That sparkles. And a peach and oops, a lemon. And a baby pink, and another peach, and a peachy brown, oh, and a very deep jady green, and another tanny brown colour, and a purpley colour, and an aqua blue, and a little bit of white. And then the last few are a brown colour, a couple of shades of a mauvey purple, another blue and another tan colour so that's all your lion colours and then all your backgrounds got like an ombre effect on the background haven't you going from your lighter colour up to your darker colour there all matching in so very very nice pop these away i've had quite a few of the uh, craft buddy kits in the past so yeah, um, if you look on my Craft Buddy playlist, you'll see some other unboxings and things. And they have got a lot of new things coming out at the moment as well. So always worth going and having a look. I do have some discount codes if you just want to drop me a message um, and I'll let you have those. I don't want to put them as like a free for all um, on my YouTube, but on my YouTube description. But yeah, if you want to just let me know and I'll let you know what they are. So we've got our two notebooks. I have actually done this one and I have used that one, fully used it up and um, put in a, like a log of all the different cards that I've made from Craft Buddy. So yeah, it's quite nice having a second one of those. But I've not had Moana before, so let's have a look at this one. Okay, so £1.67, I think you'd be hard pressed to get a hard-backed notebook um, for £1.67. <laughs> So this one has a bit more basic toolkit because it's a smaller kit. You still get your pen with your three placer and your single placer. Uh, lots of grip seal bags and just a little white boat and a piece of wax. So the notebooks, as I say, are actually hard back, which a lot of the notebooks that you get are a bit smaller than this. And they don't have the hard back on them. Um, they are just the like soft cover. So these are a lot more rigid really good size and uh, they do come with the lines in as well you get your craft buddy bits there 
and then they are all aligned pages i believe it's about 50 pages but what i like is the fact that you've got the little dots at the bottom of the page there and at the top of the page there at a centimeter increments so if you're wanting to draw straight lines down to make yourself a grid to whatever size you've got uh, markers so that you can see that but yeah excellent quality and then you also get your satin ribbon in the middle as well so i've had quite a few of the notebooks in the past but uh, yeah they are definitely worth having and um, i think my favorite one is the school one which seems to be out of stock quite a bit <laughs> all right i'll do a quick measure i think they're about 10 inches yeah 10 inches which is 26 centimeters that way by seven inches which is uh, 18 centimeters okay so really good size that's very pretty again partial so it's only um the words there that have gems on the little flower her awe oh, and then just her hair and her outfit her body and her face don't have any gems on because it is quite small if you tried putting gems on there and um, it would probably not come out very well you'd lose a lot of the details so and it, with it being um a partial and with it being a, a notebook i would seal this one so that if you are putting it in and out of a bag or handling a lot of, uh, speak english list uh, if you are handling it a lot then you're not going to lose any gems off it because with the best will in the world they do stick on and they don't come off but if you start move you know pressing against them or something rubs against them then they are going to move and possibly pop off so you know it's always worth just putting that sealer on just to protect your work you don't want all your beads dropping off <laughs> uh, again your generic little leaflet there oh more notebooks so um i've done that one i gifted that one last christmas i've done that one and gifted it i've done that one and gifted it um that one i kept myself and have done and i did uh, no i didn't do that one but i have gifted it and i think i did that one and gifted it as well so i've had all four of those now and that one it's just the other two and stokes ones that i've not had yet but uh, yeah <laughs> i've had a lot of craft buddy items um, oh right so you do get a little key code in with this one as well which is nice uh, it must have been one of the newer ones because originally they didn't put these in so you've got your crystal codes and your dmc codes in this and uh, it shows you there the picture and then it shows you there what the crystal area is that you're putting it on you've actually got how many of your gems as well that you've got on here so that's good so we've got a mixture of your standard resin gems and then anything with a starting with an, a double o at the beginning um is actually a crystal so it looks like we've got the one two three four five six seven different crystals on this one as well so it's a mixture Ooh, different and um, quite uh, nice quick easy projects to do but very effective and very useful it's a notebook so the resin ones are a brown and a salmony pink and a paler pink and a tan colour and a peach and a pale peach and that is a 310 black oh no it's not it won't be will it because it's further down the list it is oh 3371 which i think is a very very dark brown and then the standard crystal a red crystal oh we've got a hot pink yay hot pink a pale gold and a lemony gold and an aqua colour and then another pink at the end so yeah a good mixture of colours you always get plenty of gems as well you do always have uh, extras left over with your craft buddy kit it used to be 30 percent i think you got extra but i think you get at least 10 percent now something like that they have cut down a little bit on them which is fair enough i mean really as long as you've got enough to do your kit then that's all you need um, but uh, I'm greedy, I like having the extra spares as well. <laughs> so I'm just going to put that little key code in with the gems so that I know what belongs to what. And then we'll just have a quick look at the Lion King one. As I say, I have actually done this one. I have got a fully completed one. Let me see if I can just see it without stepping on any dogs. Oh dear, I've put it in a safe place and I don't know where that safe place is at the moment. <laughs> there fun and games right so 
yep, uh, same tool kit, pen boat wax uh, with your three placer and all your little grip seal bags. And then this one is exactly the same size, uh, the same pages on the inside with your lines and your little dots so you can make them into squares or rectangles or whatever or graphs and then your little satin ribbon so you can mark out where you are on your page so yeah uh, this one just has sort of the middle bits uh, diamond painted and this one the zazu was not diamond painted um simba isn't and oh we've got timon there as well look so yeah it's lovely this one i think this was the first of the notebooks that craft buddy did that i bought um, and did for myself and i said i've used it for my diamond painting cards that i've done from craft buddy uh, again the same generic leaflet so we have our little key code again showing you your picture and then which bits are diamond painted and this one looks like oh we are all resin gems there isn't any crystals on this one which i think is fair enough i do tend to find that i prefer animals to just be in the plain uh, gems or well plain they're not plain are they because they do sparkle with the facets on them but uh, not the crystals i do prefer them that way i think uh, but yeah look at that you can always put a little bit of a, an ab in place of the 5200 um, is it Rafiki? Put his little tummy, look, he could put some uh, little white uh, AB coated ones, little uh, extra sparkly ones on his tummy. <laughs> to go with his personality, I like Pumba best. I think Timon and Pumba just make me laugh every time I see him, but Pumba's just really, really funny. Particularly when he sings. <laughs> Okay, so we've got a little bit of cream, a grey, a pinky brown colour, a dark brown, a tan, a dark sort of chestnutty brown, a mustard colour, uh, like a caramel chocolate colour, peach, beige, darker beige, brown, a little bit of a grey blue and a dark grey. So yeah, that is your colour palette on those. How many colours was there? 14 on this one, so not too many. Again, all the MC codes with it, so if you keep your gems, you can pop them all away. Okay, so that's just... Uh, well, I mean, they are sort, sort of my bag and buys that were found for me uh, by our daughter. So, yeah, our lovely little 30 by 30 canvas and then the little notebook to match. Actually, they're quite a nice present to give to somebody out there, the two together. And then we have a Moana in a little notebook as well. OK, well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me. As I say, I've not gone into a huge amount of detail on this unboxing because I realise I have done a lot of unboxing on Craft Buddy notebooks and canvases and things in the past. So if you do want to check out my playlist for that as well, there is a lot of them. If you have enjoyed looking at these with me, then a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And if you want to join our little family and see what we get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So you're not going to miss anything. Yay! OK, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.